Hey, we are the Vicky shit. I hope you, that's Vicky in the background. I'm feeling something different right now. Let me just turn her down a little bit, but that's massive attack. I live for that. Hey. <laughs> I'm back, the Vicky Show, and it's season two, and um, I just want to welcome, um, I had um, London on yesterday, and Pop, they had, you know, that's, they, they, they kicked season two off with a bang, it was cute, but speaking of Bruce interview, Pop Gotti, better known as my son, he's, um, remember when he said something about Juka? Hold on, I love my apple juice. Remember when he said, um... About the Juco situation, Chantel's man, where they cleared that up or whatever, and it's, it's, and it's no beef. So basically, it was a big misunderstanding, and that was that. Juco, actually, you could come on the show and clear it up yourself, though. So everybody can hear. But I report the story, so um, shout out to Juco and shout out to Chantel. Speaking of Chantel, it's a lot of tea. I'm seeing all this shit on Twitter. Uh huh, Kwanis won a battle. What's all that about? Chantel, you was up here like a couple of weeks ago. You know, you can um clear the air, Kwanis. Huh. Also, I wanna shout, I wanna break the news. My sister coach is home. Coach is here with her. She's gonna do the show. Um, but you know, she got herself together. She had to groom herself up. Look at me, I'm still looking rusty. Y'all will never see us again on the show. I'm so sorry. You know, I just keep Sarah though. I just be chilling. I'm at Sarah Estate right now, and I'm chilling with Sarah. So I could do this. And I also want to shout out the comments that y'all give. Y'all show me so much love, and I'm so thankful for that. Thank you so much for the love and all the support, and keep everything going. Now, Ken was supposed to come on today. Well, he booked last minute. You know what I'm saying? I usually don't do last minutes anyway. So, he probably go, he can do it next week. We can chat, sit down, talk to you. He just said he had a lot he want to say and get off his chest. And actually, you know, he was linked to my, um, that girl. I don't even want to mention her name, but that's another story. And, um, I just got a shocking call. Well, I, have a, I was talking to somebody this morning. I love my apple juice. Mott, that's the name of it. But anyway, shout out to my best friend Tyron. She had her Yorkies. One of her Yorkies died, or whatever. The Prince Junior. She loved her dogs. My sister loved her dogs. So I just want to shout out her with her dogs. Also, Fresh Boys tomorrow with the Bumble Kiki Ball. I have my team and everything like that. It's just a lot. Of, it's, just, it's just so stressful. Whatever, Dylan. You know, you know how you work on somebody else's time. It can be stressful. Working on somebody else's time, you know what I'm saying? Because they do things, they they do things on their time, and I, I mean that's understandable because that's how I work. I mean everybody works like that on their time. That's why I hate fun like that. A situation where I need people or I need I hate fun like that. That's the worst fun ever. It, it it really is because it's crazy. But shout out to Kamara. He's supposed to be doing me an over 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 production. So I hope um he get that situated for me. Um, I also want to get in, um, uh, yeah, so I want to basically talk about, um, like, different things, like, you know, I want to go with different directions sometimes, you know, I know y'all love the tea, y'all love the drama, y'all love the gas, y'all love what I give, but today I was, you know, I want to take it to a serious note real quick, we're going to do this, we're going to always, or season two, we're going to give you one day out of a week, we're going to give you, um, a topic to talk about real life stuff. And today's topic is basically about molestation. Now, it was this Balenciaga boy. I'm not going to say it. But, he got, you know, it's serious, on a serious note, though, he got molested as a, ch a kid or whatever. And you saw the whole precious story. That whole story was about that. And that's a sad situation. And even Monique, if y'all watched the Oprah show, Monique had her brother. Her brother was molested Monique. And that's that's sad, I don't know it may be. And they always say it's people close to you. Like, it could be a family member. It could be a next-door neighbor. Or it could be, like, it's always, it's always somebody in the family. And 9 out of 10, they also said that if you was, like, a, um, if you are the victim of a, you know, a child molestation story, you are a person that come in as a kid. Just because it happened to you. People, yeah, it's been talked about. So, 
Me personally, I never got molested, molested or anything like that. I don't want to go ever go through something like that or whatever. And yeah, I don't, I don't, I hope the pressure story open doors for people that don't want to be, you know, don't, don't want to be involved in something like that. That's nothing to be involved in. You know what I'm saying? That's nothing. So I, I, I wish people luck and, you know, that they won't have to go through that. Now, if you ever been accustomed to that, I want people to come on the show and talk about it. I, I like, let's talk about some real life shit. It's always good to talk about some real life shit. No shade. Also, I want to jump into a little bit of bisexual. Now, I don't believe in bisexual. I don't believe in it. I think that's just a cover up for boys. Sarah is walking around her estate feeling kind. And we just smoked our motherfucking blunt. But anywho, so bisexuals. Like I said, I really don't believe in all of that. I don't. I really, 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 really don't. But I'm not knocking nobody who are, but I'm just not into that and I don't believe in that. Also, shout out to New York. New York, I'm going to give you your right credentials because that was on season one. And I don't, anywho. So I didn't give you your right credentials. So I want to just um, shout you out. Thank you for the whole Vicky intro. Thank you for all that. I love you, dear. You are, you are just a lovely girl. And I'll be back. On the Vicky Cotty Show. I love you all for watching.